Uh, are you guys ready for your first actual comic? Yeah. He's on a puddle. Yes! Um, she's very funny. I've never seen her before, but it's, I'm assuming. She's played at clubs and colleges all over the world. And also clubs and colleges all over the state of California. Um, and places near and far. Uh, please give it up for Erin Shower! Bitches. How long have you guys been? Have you guys been here since like 4.30 in the afternoon? It's happy hour, Christ. Look at her. She wants to kill herself with that glass, like, shh. How long have you been here, like, for real? Did you come see a friend who's drunk in the bathroom or something and she won't even get up? Really? Look at her, it's true. Are you drunk? I bet your name's Cynthia or some shit like that. She's from Orange County. How you doing? It's gonna be that kind of show, bitches. That's for my homies, I'm just saying. Thank you. My name's Erin, and I'm from Ohio. Yeah. I know, bitch. Hide yourself in your purse, that's all I'm saying. What's your name? Oh, Jennifer. Bitch, are you from, like, Minnesota or some shit? Born and raised here? Where? Where the fuck are you from? She's from Rhode Island. Who, that's like being from, like, North Dakota. Or, like, Idaho. Or, you know, or Vermont. I saw a Vermont, you know, like, it looks like the Capital One credit card. The, 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 I'm just making an observation. Thank you, Christ. Who is that? I love you. I could fart on a snare drum right now and somebody would crack the fuck up. That's all I'm saying. All right, shit. Thank you. Hey. All right, well, again, my name's Aaron. I'm from the Midwest. And um, I've been out in uh, California for like like three years, 17 years, I don't fucking know, I lost count. And um, I, you know, like, who's, anybody from the Midwest out here? Yeah. Yeah. That's right, where are you from? And do you, uh, no, I'm from Milford, Ohio. You know what I'm talking about. Maybe not, I know, it's fine. I don't know where the fuck it is either. We were overalls and a pitchfork every day, so. I'm not kidding. We have the Gap outlet, we don't even actually have the Gap. <laughs> You know what I'm talking about? The, the fucking, you have to get there at like 8 o'clock in the morning to get anything. Because if you get there by noon, everything's gone except for like mismatched socks and a tube top. And it's like, and the tube top's like this. It's just all fucking, you know, with the bra strap hanging out, I know. Christ. Um, so, you know, when I moved out here like 17 years ago, I didn't know that there was like a huge like language barrier between like East Coast, West Coast, you know? Throw up your gang if you're nasty. West Coast. I'm from the valley. That's right, bitches. That's right. From the val. Or the vag if you're nasty. You know, when I moved out here, you know, I, I got my job on Craigslist. Anyone else? Yeah? Anyone else a fucking communications major? That's right. I make $8 an hour answering phones for LA Business Journal. You call them, you'll get me. LA Business Journal? Super. And I'm chewing my face the entire time I'm talking to you on the phone, so I don't give a shit about your problems. So, you know, my, my, fr you know, my friends from work, like, the first week I was out there, they, like, you know, were all nice and, you know, canny and shit. So they took me out, you know, to lunch because it was my first day. And I was all excited because I was just new to L.A. And I was, like, excited because they were taking, out, taking me out to, like, you know, one of those fancy-ass fucking L.A. restaurants. Like, you know, you know Baja Fresh or Wahoo Tacos or fucking Jack in the Box Super, super Value Menu. Or, you know, I can't believe it's not vegan because it tastes like pork or, you know, fucking something like that. So, um... Somebody buy me a drink. I'm licking the lime in my drink right now. Does anyone else buy their wine from the 99 cent store? Yeah! Dude, <laughs> super, oh, th oh, thank Oh, it's half full. Thank you. That's how we do. We'll buy our wine from some homeless man's asshole. There you go. 99 cents. It's from the Behringer Vineyard. You don't know where that is. It's from Bloomington, Indiana, for Christ's sake. I know. Oh my god. You know, so we're out at lunch, and I'm, you know, whatever, and everything in L.A., I, you know, discovered when I was out here for the first time, like, takes a ticket to order your meal. So I'm, like, number 836 in line, so I'm, like, pissed off because I had to, you know, pay $1,800 for a fucking bean and cheese burrito, you know, girl, you know what I'm saying? You got the lunch hour farts, you know? So I, you know, I order my, you know, my meal, and then I was like, oh, fuck, I forgot to order a drink. So I, like, run back up to the counter, cut everybody else off, and I'm like, hey, can I get a small pop? Pop versus soda, bitches. Anyone else? Yeah. Well, you would have thought I fucking stabbed someone's baby and titty fucked Jose the cashier boy. Seriously. Seriously. It was awful. 
I know, and then like, not two seconds later, this like, anybody from Orange County? Perfect. Fuck those bitches. Laguna Beach, LC, the hills. The hills is in fucking Orange County, I don't care. Fuck them, they got the roots of trees for days. Thanks, gays. Um, thank you. Like, you know, whatever. Um, so, you know, it, I, like two seconds later, this like, her name was like Deborah or Cynthia or this bitch, whatever she's from. She taps me on the shoulder, she's like, um, and she like flips her like real expensive Delia, you know, extensions, you know, that she got from like Wet Seal or some shit, you know, TJ Maxx. Just her like really like red and black tube socks that she clipped on with like a barrette. She did, hey, it's Paris Hilton shit right there. She taps me on the shoulder and she's like, um, I don't know where the fuck you're from, but out here we call it soda. And I was already pissed off because they paid seventy five dollars for a burrito anyway. So I, you know, I just I had no shame. I like astro projected myself up off the ground, like turned myself around, threw my small pop in her face, and I'm like, bitch, I don't care what the fuck you guys call soft drinks out here, all right, sister? Because it's not like you're gonna be drinking it anytime soon, okay? So step off these nuts, thanks. Yeah. It's a true story. I don't even care, Indiana. It's I don't even care. It's a true story. So then she offered to pay for my meal on my ride home. In her Prius. I have a problem with Priuses. I don't even know whose this is. It could have been up someone's ass, but I'm just gonna. That's the polite drink when somebody buys you a drink at a bar. Hi, how you doing? Can I buy you a drink? And then you watch them the whole time with a side eye, like. And you're like, sure. Mm, how you doing? Click. So you don't get the hepatitis or mono or whatever that's around the room. Nice. So um, I, I um, from Ohio, I, I went home for the, you know, recently went home for the holidays. You know, anybody, anybody else? Yeah? Which means my parents accrued enough frequent flyer miles through Delta to fly my ass home. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, June, July, August, September, October, we don't give a shit. It's the holidays. Whenever Aaron can come home and pull her away from the 99 cent store. So anyway, I'm at home, and then you like, you know, Facebook and MySpace and fucking Twitter and butthole all your friends. And uh, you know, it's, it's, we got something here, butthole. And, um, you know, and then your friend, uh, you know, your awesome friend who doesn't you believe that they actually left high school wants to, you know, pick you up from the airport in their sweet ride, which is like the 1976 Gremlin low rider with the lights, uh, you know, underneath it all. Shit's all bashed in on the right side. There's like, you know, those fucking twine ropes from Osh, like, you know, around it so the shit doesn't fly up on the freeway. You know, picking you up, they're like, girl, I'm gonna take you on a night of the town, girl, god damn it. And you know, there's like, you know, fucking Andre champagne, you know, chilling in the back of the car and the ink glue thing. They can't even put the fucking lid on because there's no ice. It's chilling. No mixer, just Andre. No cups either. You gotta, you gotta mama bird the shit. Like, Welcome home, goddammit, Christ. So, Mama Bird, aesthetic girl. Um, so, you know, you're in the whatever, and then, you know, your friend makes you that Ohio versus LA mix, you know, like they, like you've never fucking heard single ladies before on the radio. And it's like every sick song. And then, you know, your friend has a ghetto ass car, so they have that like six disc CD changer from Sony, like 1993 bullshit, mounted like underneath the passenger seat, like under the trunk. And there's one CD in it, there's like six discs, so you know, it's like all fucked up and scratched, you know, whatever. And you know, every time you hit a speed bump, it's like, oh my single. And you can put your hands up. And you can go, and you can go, and she's fucking singing along because she's wasted in the front seat driving. And you're like, you know. Fast forward to like two o'clock in the morning, White Castle drive through, two o'clock in the morning. You know what I'm talking about? There's like 800 people in line who don't even care. And you know, you're all fucking hungry. I get a number eight. I'm trying to substitute the Diet Coke for a 20 piece cheese stick. That's what I'm talking about, god damn it. And when you get home, they don't even drop you off in your front door. They're like, I had a great time. And they pour a beer on you like it's for your homies. That's all I'm saying.